Previously, I flew up to Tasmania to help Barry sell the boat he recently purchased from Tasmania to mainland Australia. We got the boat ready and we start our voyage direction Bass Strait. But things didn't turn up as planned and we broke our sail only a few hours after leaving. Is this boat really ready for crossing Bass Strait? Hi, I'm Izzy. I decided to change my life and become an apprentice sailor with no fixed address and no fixed itinerary. I sail where the wind blow me and drop anchor to explore places that look interesting. I hope you enjoy the video and welcome aboard. All hands on deck! Good morning guys! Day 2 of our trip crossing Bay Strait. Uh, yesterday I posted on my Instagram that uh, where our sail broke and I got so many phone calls from my sailors friends and they all told me that I have to turn back, don't do that easy it's like you having sex with someone with uh, AIDS and you're hoping to not get it uh, it's just asking for death so it made me a little bit worried to be honest with you uh, Thomas, uh, another friend of mine, apparently he did this trip uh, seven times and he told me it was the only time he was scared for his life. So I'm a little bit concerned. I will talk with uh, Barry, but now I think we, we're gonna try it and see. If it's getting really, really worse, then we're gonna turn back, but hope for the best and wish us good luck guys i'm sure it's gonna be fine let's do that that's our shower guys that's why pets Breakfast time! 
After breakfast, the motor starts smoking dangerously. So Barry had a look and he realized that the drain pump was broken. So he found a system to fix it permanently. The sail, now the pump, what's gonna be next? I'm starting to wonder if I did the right choice by doing this trip on this vessel. Guys, a little bit scary. 
Mean Girls, The Red Flag Are Flying. My dream of crossing Bass Strait is turning to a nightmare. And I'm not sure anymore if this vessel has the capacity of crossing this notorious stretch of water. Don't miss out on next week's episode.